Improve fuel economy and performance. Diagnose a bad oxygen sensor and learn how to sensor symptoms yourself. Today, we're diving under the hood to talk about a crucial component in your car's engine, the oxygen sensor. This little guy plays a big role in your car's performance and fuel efficiency. We're going to cover the common signs that your oxygen sensor is on the fritz and what you can do about it. So, let's get started. What is an oxygen sensor? Before we dive into the symptoms, let's quickly understand what an oxygen sensor does. Essentially, it measures the amount of oxygen in your exhaust gases and sends this information to the engine's computer. This data helps the computer adjust the air-fuel mixture for optimal combustion. A faulty sensor can lead to a variety of issues. Where is the oxygen sensor located? The upstream oxygen sensor S are located below the exhaust manifold flanges and above the catalytic converter. The downstream oxygen sensor S are located in the exhaust pipe behind the catalytic converter. Symptoms of a bad oxygen sensor Check engine light, this is often the first indicator. A malfunctioning sensor will usually trigger this light. Poor fuel economy, you might notice your car is guzzling gas more than usual. Engine hesitation or rough idle, your car might hesitate when accelerating or experience a rough idle. Reduced power, you might feel a noticeable decrease in your car's performance. Black or white smoke from exhaust, excessive black or white smoke can be a symptom of an oxygen sensor issue. Now, it's important to note that these symptoms can also be caused by other issues, so it's always a good idea to get your car diagnosed by a professional mechanic. If you suspect your oxygen sensor is faulty, here are your options. DIY replacement, if you're mechanically inclined, you might be able to replace the oxygen sensor yourself. However, it's essential to follow the manufacturer's guidelines and use the correct replacement part. Professional mechanic, if you're not comfortable doing it yourself, take your car to a trusted mechanic. They can diagnose the issue accurately and replace the sensor if needed. And there you have it. Now you know the common signs of a bad oxygen sensor and what to do about it. Remember, this is just general information and your specific situation might vary. Always consult with a professional mechanic for accurate diagnosis and repairs. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more automotive tips and tricks. Don't forget to leave a comment below if you have any questions.